identify your territory and occupy it we've been talking about possessing the promises of god and we said that though god has promised so many blessings we too have to put up a fight to walk into those promises make them ours um, and and dwell uh, in in the land of god's blessing uh, i'd like to repeat to us joshua's statement in joshua 18 and verse 3 where he says how long will you neglect to go and possess the land which the lord of your fathers has given you and this is what joshua is talking about and he's reminding the people of what was already given to uh, uh, the children of Israel and he's also uh, trying to shake them out of their sleep and, and and he's saying how long will you neglect meaning uh, all of this belongs to you but why is it that you are not walking into uh, these regions and why is it that that you're not actively fighting the enemies in this in these regions and possessing the land now today we are not talking so much about um, physical land but you're talking about spiritual territory and spiritual territory could mean um the the blessings of god that we've got through the cross the blessings uh, that have come to us through abraham you know all of this belongs to us it already belongs to us and yet uh, if if i may just repeat the statement of joshua when he said how long will you neglect to go and possess the land which the lord your god of your fathers has given you and it's it's a, a similar call to us wh- when we are being reminded that we must not neglect any promise all the promises of god are for us to walk in uh, and so we've got to identify the territory similar to to uh, the borders that that israel was was supposed to occupy there are certain borders uh, that that we are supposed to occupy and in spiritual terms uh, this this would mean you know walking in healing maybe uh, you know we we uh, we are fighting a sickness but you know let's not give up let's believe that god has already uh, by the stripes of jesus we are already healed and so that is a territory that we have to possess uh, and spiritual territory would also mean the things that god has called to in terms of uh, uh ministry and in terms of serving him now this may refer to uh ministry as in you know uh, serving god directly um how uh, or uh, you you might you might be out there in the marketplace which is also ministry but any assignment that has been given by god to us and that too is is a territory that we have to possess you know uh, we could also look at this in terms of identifying people uh, whom god is calling us to serve in it could be a certain age group uh, that god is calling us to calling us to serve children or or youth you know are we are we effectively moving towards that are we effectively making a difference in the lives of uh, uh, these people and so uh, we've got to trust god to lead us uh, in into these territories and then on it's not going to be going to be easy it will still take uh, some effort from our side uh, in in continuing to have faith in god and 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 sow the seeds that are necessary in all these areas and continue to believe god for a harvest uh, for for souls to be one for the kingdom of god for uh, the power of god to be seen in the lives of the people so on and so forth uh, but let's not stop let's uh, be aware of all that jesus has won for us and as joshua said how long uh, shall we neglect you know all the all these wonderful blessings that god has given for us it's time to rise up identify the territory uh, and take it let's pray together heavenly father we thank you lord for the call of god on each one of our lives father we know that uh, lord uh, even as we walk in in that call and assignment to god father we walk in great fulfillment i pray god that you will enable each one of us to identify uh, uh, the areas father where where we must invest our energies father i pray that lord uh, we will effectively serve you oh god in the territories where you have called us and god thank you that you have defeated every enemy every foe god uh, the enemy that comes at us from one direction will flee in seven directions oh god and father that we will possess god every promise that you have for us we thank you once again in jesus name we pray amen thank you for tuning in to living supernaturally 
For more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk, please visit apcwo.org.